human-powered flight is soaring to new heights of scientific achievement at the University of Maryland. On July 12th, the helicopter Gamera hovered over the ground for more than 12 seconds inside Record Armory on campus. Engineering Dean Daryl Pines. What we just watched was the longest flight of a human-powered helicopter built by the University of Maryland team. It simply says that our students are really, really good. They can fly something that's never been flown before, and then they can actually try to achieve something that they didn't think they could do. The team crushed the national record of four seconds, which Gamera had set earlier this year. They also set a world record for human-powered flight by a woman. It's a really neat position to be in when you are sort of fulfilling the hopes and dreams of 50 engineers. Even more amazing is that the helicopter made its historic flight after it crashed the night before. The string fell off this rotor, so she stopped putting power to the rotor here. She put more power to the other three rotors, so the back end started to climb up. When she realized that she was tilting forward, she saw something was wrong, she stopped pedaling. The whole thing looked like a mess. Aerospace engineering professor Inderjit Chopra stayed overnight to help the students repair Gamera and was excited to see the record-breaking flight. But the project is still not finished. But next step is to redesign it, basically. Sit down with the student, redesign it. This is just the latest attempt at trying to get the $250,000 Sikorsky Prize. Dean Pines hopes that they can get the final test flight in the next six months. Reporting for the UMD News Desk, I'm Sean McCauley.